Hey, you guys, Coach Liz here. I want to talk to you a little bit about the optimization phase of your health journey. Now, once you get your, to your healthy weight, we move into the optimization phase after transition. And a lot of people used to call this maintenance phase. But when you think about that, you don't want to just stay the same, right? You want to keep getting better. And so a lot of the things that you're doing right now on your health journey are those same things that are going to help you continue to live a healthy lifestyle. So I'm going to go over my high five. These are my top health tips on healthy habits to keep moving you forward on your health journey. All right. The first one is hydration. That's such a simple thing, but such an important aspect of healthy habits, drinking lots of water. Don't drink your calories. So um, make sure you're getting into those good habits of getting plenty of water. Make that a priority throughout the rest of your life. The second thing is exercise. Exercise is so important. Just teaching yourself that you take time to do something healthy for your body. So it doesn't have to take a lot of time. It could just be a quick walk. It could be running up and down the stairs for five minutes, but doing something intentional every day for your body, just it does so much for your mindset, but also for your body. It's just healthy for you. All right, number three, balanced nutrition. That's one thing that we're really working on is learning to eat small balanced meals every two and a half to three hours. Now what that's going to do is it's going to keep your inflammation down. It will help your blood sugar stay balanced, keep your metabolism running well, and really keep you feeling good for the rest of your life. And we'll help you keep that simple also. All right, the fourth one is sleep. Sleep is so important. Make sure you're getting at least seven to hours of restful sleep. And you can check out your um, Dr. A's Habits of Health book or your life book for great tips on how to get better sleep. All right, the fifth one is your mindset. Now this includes stress management, um, also being mindful in your eating. So stop challenging and choosing before you make a choice, not reacting to emotions. So it's good during your health journey to really recognize these triggers, the way that you buffer and start working on changing those habits. So instead of turning for a buffer like food or sleep or um, Netflix, learning to process those emotions and learning how to actually do things that help you relax, take 10 deep breaths, go for a walk, um, and really processing those emotions instead of covering them up. That's really going to help you to avoid getting back into emotional eating habits or bad habits um, that kind of probably got you where you started in the first place, right? So those are my five top tips, my high five for um, optimizing your health long-term. Again, drinking your water, exercise, sleep, balanced nutrition, and healthy mindset. All right, I want you to remember those throughout your health journey and be practicing those. And remember, this first phase of getting healthy, of losing weight, that's just the first step on your journey. You get to enjoy this healthy lifestyle for the rest of your life, and it feels amazing. All right, have a good day.